So it appears the U.S. is still uh, manufacturing that consent for war with Iran. Manufacturing consent. You, you know what that, that comes from. That's Noam Chomsky uh, wrote the book in the 90s about manufacturing consent, which is, which is basically creating false flags, creating uh, situations that compromise your opponent, and, uh, but it's, it's generally based on lies. It's like uh, an employer writes up, a, you know, 10 phony, you know, gives you 10 phony write-ups and shit that didn't happen, and then you get fired, right? So that's, that's kind of what's going on, in my view. Uh, so Iran, Iran just gunned down a U.S. drone flying in their backyard. Wow, how, how, how uh, deviant of them to shoot down the drone flying in their backyard. Uh, so let's take a look, right? So here, here's um, the latest. Uh, Iran warns U.S. after drone violated its airspace uh, to protect themselves. So this is uh, General Iran's Revolutionary Guard uh, commander, Hassan Salaman. Salaman, right? Mr. Salaman. As a general in Iran, Iran uh, said that, the latest development said that there was a drone flying in their backyard, right? So let's let's read a little bit. So, so do, Dubai, um, the United Arab Emirates, the latest on developments in the Persian Gulf region amid rising tensions between Iran and the U.S. Iran foreign minister has warned the United States over violating Iran's airspace after the Revolutionary Guard shot down a U.S. drone earlier earlier in the day. Again, a drone is a is an empty plane. It's a piece of equipment. Right, they shot a piece of equipment. They didn't shoot at humans. They didn't shoot. Right, that piece of equipment was flying in their backyard, taking pictures of them, and they shot it down. Right? Is it in international space? Well, let's take a look at where the drone actually was. Is it international space? Because it doesn't look like it was. Foreign uh, Iran's foreign minister has uh, minister the minister spokesman Ababa Abiyaba Habaha. <laughs> is quoted by the semi-official Tasnim news agency as saying that Iran cannot condone the, quote, illegal trespassing and invading of the country's skies by any kind of foreign flying objects. <laughs> Could you imagine if Iran flew a drone off the coast of New Jersey, how fast they would shoot that shit down? Uh, they'd blow the fucking thing into pieces, right? And people would be selling the pieces on eBay. Iran's Revolutionary Guard says it shot down the American drone over Iran airspace, while U.S. officials say it happened over international space. In the Strait of Horm Hormoz. Strat of Hormoz. Where the hell is that, man? Where the fuck is that? Strat of Hormoz. Let's take a look. The Strat of Hormoz. Where in the world is it? Where in the fucking world is it? Around and round she goes, where she stops, nobody knows. Let's see. Uh, in the Strat of Hormoz. Strat of Hormoz. There it is. So so look where we are. No, no, no. Look where we are. Here's where we are. And here's where we have a drone flying in international space. <laughs> in Iran's backyard. Right? Let's just confirm that this is, in fact, the Strat of Hormuz. You could see it, right? Strat of Hormuz. Hormuz? That's right in the backyard, right? It's fucking Iran. Right? That's Iran's backyard, right? Here's the Gulf of Oman. Here's the Persian Gulf, right? Here's all the floor. You know, you got to get around this shit, right? And here's, here's, here's uh, this is United Emirates, right? The United, this is Dubai, right? United Emirates. Where's United? Oh, here it is. United Emirates, uh, Qatar, Bahrain, right? And we got a drone flying right in their backyard, right? So Iran shoots it down. Shoots it down, right? They, the U.S. is confirming that it was in the, the, I, the, the strat. Where? How, how many miles? Where's the miles? Yeah, this thing, this down, down here is 10 miles, right? What, the whole thing doesn't look like it's 50 miles, right? And we got a drone flying right up their ass, right up their ass, and they shoot it down, right? So, so the point is, did the U.S. put a drone in the fucking strat of Homaz? Just to, just to to have this guy say, "Pow, we're gonna shoot that shit down," right? Is that aggressive? To I don't know. Is that aggressive to shoot down a drone flying in your backyard? 
taking pictures of your, your, your children and your family. I don't know about that. It sounds like instigating. That's what it sounds like to me. <clears throat> so what else can we find out about this stupid story? Before, before uh, Pompeo and, and John Bolton come out and say, the Iranians have violated civil, violated international law by shooting down our equipment in their backyard. That's what they're going to say. It's consenting. It's manufacturing consent. That's what it is. They're going to use this as another reason. They've already accused Iran of blowing up the, the, the tanker or shooting the tanker or, or, or uh, gluing mines to the side of the two oil tankers in, in the same area. It's all, it's all bullshit. Man. It's all fucking bullshit. Get out of their backyard. Get out of their back. Get out of my yard. Get off my grass. Iran's saying, get off my grass. Fly your fucking kite somewhere else, man. Don't fly your kite in my fucking yard. Right. Saudi Arabia says, Yemen's Houthi rebels have fired a rocket into the kingdom targeting a... Uh, this is un, I guess it's unrelated, right? So, so that's, the, that's the big, big story here, right? It's, and everybody's reporting it. I think, oh, yeah, the post has a, a little something of what, what the drone looks like. So it's just a headless horseman, you know. It's like a it's it's a it's a drone with no no pilot. It's a big ass plane, you know. It's like what the hell is in there? It's like a flying camera. You're flying a giant camera into my backyard, man. Fucking get that shit out of there, man. Get that shit out of there, man. What do we do to you? What do we do to you? Nothing. And do nothing to you, man. Don't fucking do nothing to you. Get your shit out my yard. Beautiful plane, right? If it was used, you know, if it was used properly. So foreign minister on Thursday expressed, uh, they, they're not, they're not uh, denying it. Tehran, Tehran is not, uh, Iran, you know, Tehran, the city in Iran, <laughs> is not denying that they shot the plane down. That's not in dispute, right? Um, we strongly condemn this kind of aggressive and provocative action, Right? We warn against any uh, violation of Iran's airspace by foreign, f by foreign flying objects and declare that violators are responsible for the consequences of their actions. I don't know how you could really dispute that. I don't, I'm not really sure how you, could, how you would argue uh, you know, for the U.S., right? Why, you, first of all, the, the location. That's the single most important thing. Why is your drone, your drone that you say is your drone, is shot down by people that say they shot it down in their backyard. Why is your drone in there in that close? Do you have any business there? Do you have any right to be in there? What happens in Venezuela, right? When 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 China or 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 Russia comes within ten feet of Venezuela, the U.S. is 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 crying is banging a war drum. Right? This is the, this is, I, I mean it's just the kind of country we live in. It's, it's fucking warmongers, right? We don't own the globe, right? We don't. We have no business being there. It doesn't make our lives safer. That's what the military is supposed to be. It's defense, not offense. It's defense. Uh, so here's a plane. Here's the here's the drone. Of, uh, apparently, a shot, a photograph of the drone getting knocked out of the sky, and um, it's affecting the crude. Crude oil price, oh boy, fucking, that's so important, man. Crude oil is getting hit because the region is becoming unstable. I, I don't know, man. I, I don't know if if I know that if if we if someone wants if some rich cocksucker wants to knock down the price of oil, they could in institute or instigate some some drone strikes uh, or some of this this theater that we're seeing. It's like Kabuki theater, right? It's fake. In my view, so so anyway, that, that's so that's the latest bang on the drum. John Bolton and uh, and, and and Elliot Abrams with Trump. You well, don't separate Trump from Bolton and, and Elliot Abrams. If you want to separate, if if you want a separation there, bang on the drum and start telling Trump to get out. He's he's out and fucking he's out in front of the cameras, rallying to get reelected. Why don't you cut some of these guys loose? Why don't you cut some of these guys loose? It's your cabinet. As he's doing it. They're doing it in our name, and you're 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 you hired them to do it, right? What happened to you fired? Right? What happened to you fired? Right? A bunch of fucking liars, right? A bunch of warmongers, right? Cut it out, man. Cut it out. Stop instigating war with a with a with a, a, a relatively peaceful country that 
But uh, maybe you just don't understand. You don't, you know, you don't know what's going on over there. I know, fucking, oh no, they're Muslim, they're fucking Arabs, they're fucking spooky. Yeah, they're, they're, they're called fucking Allah, my my They hate us. It's so fucking so stupid, man. Guys are so fucking stupid, man. So, Marcus Conte reporting on the uh, on the down drone. <laughs>